Bienvenidos a mi canal y estoy ahora con un gringo en Tijuana. Hola, bueno, tú diles cómo te llamas. Uh, tell your name. Ah, me, me llamo es Clayton. Okay. Yeah. Me, no hablo español. No, español no. es muy malo, lo siento. Yeah, okay. Entonces, dinos. Oh, I'm gonna say it in Spanish and then. Dinos cómo te has sentido viviendo mm -hmm. en México. How do you feel living in, in Mexico? Uh, How's your I love it. I love living in Mexico. The people are super nice, like Mike. Uh, the food is incredible. It's very different than the United States. Very different, but I like it. I like the difference. What do you like the most of living here? ¿Qué es lo que más te gusta de vivir aquí en Tijuana? Aquí en Tijuana es the food. The food is the best. I visited many places in Mexico. Uh, Guadalajara, Mexico City. Oh, you've been to Guadalajara? Yeah, yeah. I don't know, okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but for me, the food in Tijuana is the best. Uh, the best part about Tijuana, because we have all of these different cultures. American, Mexican, Asian, Central American, Caribbean, all of these different unique flavors uh, come together in the cuisine here. It's super unique and uh, in my opinion the best tacos in the world yes. are right here in Tijuana. Tacos, yeah. Yeah. Y otra cosa, another thing is that we have the border here. Yes, that's, that's true. So for me, like if I get homesick and I miss the United States, I just cross cross in 30 minutes I can go to Target or you know whatever target. I miss whatever I miss from the US right if I want in and out burger I yeah, can go because we don't have target here or in and out no tenemos la tienda esa target ni el in and out de las hamburguesas pero ya yeah. yeah so it's uh, Tijuana is really unique in that way because I feel like I can live in two countries and two cultures very very easily sí. Yo crecí aquí en Tijuana. I grew up here all my life. But uh, lo que me gusta también es de que estamos en la frontera. Entonces, cualquier cosa que, que no sé, hay cosas que no tenemos aquí en México que podemos comprar de allá. Many things we can buy from there that we don't have here. Uh, cosas más baratas que puedes encontrar ofertas. La ropa, la gente va a comprar ropa allá porque está más barata y es un poco mejor calidad en algunas y pues no está tan caro. Clothes and food and all that. One, uh, one thing that, that I really think is special about Tijuana is the growing up in the border region. The people from here are, are unique from the other parts of Mexico because you have cultural influence from the United States. A lot of people oh, yes. grow up here with uh, speaking English or some level of English. Uh, most people that grow up here in Tijuana they go to San Diego and you can see behind us all of the people that are going to the United States right now. Every day is like this, every day. It's the it's the busiest crossing in the world, I, yeah. I think. A few moments later. Bien, entonces estamos aquí en la revolución, aquí en Tijuana. No les había dicho quién era eh, mi amigo, se llama Clayton, pero no les dije de dónde es. Tell us where you're from, de dónde eres. So originally I'm from Oklahoma City, which is about 2,000 kilometers from here. 2,000 kilometers, okay. Now, we met through YouTube. Nos conocimos por medio de YouTube porque él tiene unos videos que hizo aquí en Tijuana. Muy chidos. Se los voy a dejar en la parte de abajo y acá arriba también para que vayan a verlos. Por eso yo estaba buscando videos de gringos en México y me salió uno de sus videos. His videos came up when I was looking for, you know, uh, gringos in Mexico <laughs> and I saw your videos and I really like them. I really like how you show uh, Tijuana and our culture and our food. That's very, very important for me, the food and for all of us here in Tijuana. <laughs> Yo también. Yo también? Yeah, okay. Sí. So what, what do you like about this, this place? Do, have you been here before? Yeah, so my very first time to come to Tijuana, I came to Revolution because that was just where you go. 
and I was walking down the street and I discovered the tacos. And the tacos here were completely different than the tacos I had in Oklahoma or anywhere else. Yeah. Uh, so my, my second food experience with the tacos were incredible and I fell in love. The, the next food experience I had was actually right here on this street. It was, uh, right here. Right here on Revolution. Here? Not in this exact oh, okay. spot, but on this street. Okay. There's a, there's a uh, Caesars Hotel is here. And I learned that Caesars Hotel is where the Caesar salad was invented. Uh -huh. yes, and so right. as soon as I heard that, I said, I have to try this Caesar salad. So I go into the hotel, I order a Caesar salad, and I expect them to bring out a plate with the salad. No. They bring out a cart with all of the ingredients. They make the dressing at the table, mix all of the ingredients together, and make the salad right in front of you. It was a great experience, and it was the best Caesar salad I've ever had, which makes sense because it's the original right okay so I want to ask you something um, how do you feel walking in the street como te sientes caminando en las calles like by, if you're by yourself do you feel safe do you feel because uh, you know a lot of people they get a little bit you know about coming to Tijuana they don't feel like it's safe what, how do you feel? As a gringo, tell us, please. Yeah, so here in Tijuana, I've never had a bad experience. Uh, I'm also careful. I'm, I'm a little more careful here than maybe I would be in the United States. Uh, but I've never felt unsafe or afraid or nervous. Um, there are certain parts of the city that I know are more dangerous than others. Yeah. Here in Revolution, there are lots of people, lots of police. It's very, very safe, very, very comfortable. Uh, so I've never, I've never felt scared or afraid here in Tijuana. Okay. And how long have you lived here? Here I've lived two months, but I've been visiting for almost 10 years. 10 years? Almost 10 years I've been visiting. Wow. I've seen the city change. In 10 oh, yeah. years, it's become, uh, there are more people, there are more businesses, the food in the last 10 years, the food has just become exponentially better. Uh, there are all kinds of famous chefs and places to eat here that didn't exist 10 years ago. Yeah, Tijuana has become very uh, good at food. Yes. <laughs> yes. I think. I think so. Lleva una hora y no sé qué está haciendo. Ya llegamos a los tacos. Estoy listo. Ah, estoy, ¿Estás listo? Ok. Llegamos a los tacos. Vuelta. Vuelta por el Vuelta. 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 Ahí lo estamos grabando, van a seguir grabando, esperando. Gringo comiendo tacos. This is the best part about Tijuana. Other parts of Mexico. This is what we came for, right? Absolutely. Other parts of Mexico have good tacos. Right here is the only place with this uh, uh, guacamole. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is very like unique, right? To this area? Very unique. Perfect. A ver si es cierto. ¿Ya comes chile? Sí. A ver. Ay, güey, sí. Sí, come chile. Ah, pero eso ni pica. It's not, it's not real chile. No, no, it's not. Not spicy. No, but it's good, right? Yeah, perfect. <laughs> I like, I like this. I like this. Oh yeah, it's good. I like this one. You want to try it? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what, is it, is it hot? No, it's not hot. Let's try. Try it. Mm. 
little warm. Warm? That's not bad. Yeah, it's, like not, it. it's not spicy. Yeah, no. Better than that. For the tacos. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm like, okay, it'll be hot any moment. But no, no, no it has a uh, good taste. Yeah. Tiene buen sabor, por eso me gustan las salsas. Ah, pues bueno, ya. Llegamos al final de este video, fuimos a comer muy buenos tacos And, uh, Gracias por ver este video, compártanlo y sus no, se acuerden, no se olviden de suscribirse a mi canal y ver todos mis videos Les mando saludos a todos and thank you for watching and you want to say something? Yeah, thanks for watching um, Yeah, so if you want to come to uh, Tijuana, come visit, send, uh, leave, a, leave a comment on Mike's channel Mm -hmm. uh, if you're gonna come visit, maybe we'll take you to some great tacos and the best tacos, the best, the best in Tijuana and the best in the world. Yes. Yeah. And if you have any questions about Tijuana, uh, ask Mike. Leave a comment on his channel. Or also, you can. Uh, I'm gonna leave his channel so you can go check it out with his cool videos that he's done about this city and he also knows a lot about this city so you can also ask him right yeah if you're curious and what tijuana is like uh through the eyes of a gringo you can subscribe <laughs> to my channel yes and we're on instagram and yeah that's it awesome